Following developing stories just into the newsroom here at WHAS 11 News, a federal court has blocked SB 150 just hours before it was set to take effect in Kentucky. The law would have banned gender affirming care for transgender kids, including puberty blockers, hormone therapy. Governor Bashir vetoed the bill, but it was overturned. The ACLU then asked for an injunction, calling the law unconstitutional, and today that injunction was granted. Well, the ACLU has released a statement on this. Again, this is a late-breaking decision, saying in part, quote, this is a win, but it is only the first step. We're prepared to fight for families, families' right to make their own private medical decisions in court, and to continue doing everything in our power to ensure access to medical care is permanently secured in Kentucky. Meantime, Attorney General and gubernatorial candidate Daniel Cameron is criticizing the decision, saying, saying this today. Uh, Daniel Cameron saying today's misguided decision by a federal judge tramples the right of the General Assembly to make public policy for the Commonwealth. It is, there is nothing affirming about this dangerous approach to mental health, and my office will continue to do everything in our power to defend this law passed by our elective representatives.